What's up, YouTube? Thank you for clicking. So I wanted to go ahead and get this out of the way because every time I make videos like this, I usually get a couple people who say a couple comments like, hey, you know this is all a, a, a part of a plan, right? Yes, I'm very well aware of this. I do understand that Iran, Korea, China, those guys aren't really our enemies. Um, they are being told to do what they are doing. So I'm just, I'm a big movie watcher. I used to be a big movie watcher. Let me back that up. I used to watch a but I have a huge collection. I used to buy a DVD every week, if not several. I used to be a huge movie watcher. Then I woke up and realized that the world that we live in is better than any kind of Hollywood garbage that's ever been put out before. And as a matter of fact, all the stuff that Hollywood has put out anyway has either happened in the past, is happening now, or is going to happen in the future. So I like to keep up with this, with the play. If you, if you will, if you want to call it that, or movie, whatever. And I know a lot of other people out there do too, so that's what this video is about. Yes, I'm aware it's a plan, but I love the drama. What can I say? So I'm over here at the uh, ISIS site, right? And today, or not today, a couple days ago, I found it today, but a couple days ago, they put out this report. And this is all about how Iran is up to something at one of their little nuclear facilities. Now, I'm going to read just a couple paragraphs to get you caught up on of this parching site that they're talking about and what, they're, what the whole purpose of this report is. And uh, it's nine pages. The last, uh, I think it's the last three or four are pictures. But uh, in the, uh, before these pages, what I'll do is I'll just scroll down like I'm doing now and just kind of give you a summary of what, they're t of what, they, what they talk about in the report. And I'll put the link below if you're inter interested in reading the whole thing. So first of all, let's get into what this is a whole this whole thing's about. Recent commercial satellite imagery of the Parchin site in Iran shows the extent of new paving as well as the extent of other alternations undertaken at the site over the past year and ha and a half starting in February 2012. Iran appears to be in the final stages of modifying the suspected high explosive test at the Parchin complex, having received uh, I'm sorry, having recently asphalted large sections of the site. As noted in several of the IAEA's quarterly Iran safeguards reports and in numerous ISIS satellite imagery reports on Parchin, asphalting and the other documented activities has have significantly changed the site and impacted the ability of IAEA inspectors to collect environmental samples and other evidence that, could, uh, that it could use to determine whether nuclear weapons related activities once took place there. Asphalting an entire area in this manner would make it very hard to take soil samples and likely be effective at covering up environmental evidence of nuclear weaponization related experiments. Iran in 2003 and 2004 conducted similar concealment activities at however you say that, raising and rebuilding the entire site in an effort uh, suspected to be aimed at concealing alleged undeclared military nuclear efforts. And it goes a little bit more into that. Next page talks about how as you can see with their pictures this and then they talk about well we've taken some pictures this is what we've seen and then they give this list here on this third page um, it says right here over the last year and a half Iran has undertaken many alternations of the site many of which look like efforts to destroy evidence and are documented in earlier ISIS satellite imagery reports and they talk about all the stuff this is a list of what they consider evidence that they have found in the pictures they've taken and then this next page I'm sorry, this next part leading into the next page is all about how Iran, they've come out, of course, anybody's been paying attention to this stuff, they come out and say, oh, we're not up to anything, look, you guys are just being paranoid buttholes, just leave us alone, we're not up to anything, we're not concealing anything, we're not covering it up, and then ISIS says right here, another claim made in the letter, because they're talking about how their Iran has addressed the IAEA in a letter saying, we're cool, Don't just leave us alone, we're not up to anything, ISIS says that in a letter, they made a clumsy attempt at dismissing or misdirecting focus at the Parchin site. So they, you know, so they're saying that Iran's not even doing a good job of denying this that this is going on. And that's pretty much about it. And then you can go here and see the pictures for yourself. You can clearly see because this is the after picture, and then this is the before picture. So you can clearly see that they have indeed um, made some significant modifications to the site. Assuming these are real pictures, I don't know. I don't go on Google Earth and do that stuff. But uh, you know, what what are you gonna do? So the links will be below. Um, I don't know if this means anything. Uh, Iran, I really do believe, is going to be one of the people that you're know, one of the countries. I'm sorry that gets blamed for whatever happens. So you know, all this all this buildup of war with them and war with uh, Korea and war with China and war with Russia, it's not leading to nowhere. That's going to be used in the future for something. So I just wanted to share this with everybody because I thought it was kind of neato. Uh, links will be below in case you want to read the whole report. Thank you to all my teammates. Thank you to all my subscribers. 
And I uh, appreciate all the support. We'll see what happens in the future. I think stuff's about to pop off here shortly, but who knows for sure. Hard to tell at this point. So thanks again, everybody.